And now it comes to the second problem. In this problem, x is uniform in the interval a to the b, and y equals x squared. In order to calculate the density function of y, we have to first ca calculate the distribution function of y. And according to my solution, uh, we have to we have to uh, calculate the corresponding interval for the y according to the x. And then we take the derivative of the distribution function, and then we get the probability density function of y. When a equals minus 1 and b equals 3, the problem comes to a little bit uh, more specific. And if we want to uh, draw the and calculate and draw the graph of the dis uh, density function of y, we must notice that uh, when y, there's two intervals. When y uh, from 0 to 1, there's only, uh, there's two roots. So, Corresponding, corresponding uh, f form of y is shown as follows, and from y equals one to zero uh, to to nine, there's only one root. So the distribution function of that part is a little bit different. And if we notice this, and this uh, problem is going to be easier, and the graph is shown in in my solution.